guys how are you all doing i hope life is treating you well so today we've got another makeup video if you've been following my channel a while you'll know that i've done a lot of makeup based content i absolutely love getting my makeup done i'm gonna link a full playlist below which will include every single video i've done that is kind of makeup related not like a makeup tutorial but like getting my makeup done certain places and stuff i'll have a full playlist below in case these videos interest you today i am actually probably the most excited for a makeup video than I've been in a long time. I'm gonna be getting my makeup done at Charlotte Tilbury. I started using Charlotte Tilbury products probably about a year and a half ago. I use quite a few of their products on the daily. I use the Magic Cream, I use the Duo Compact with the bronzer and highlight. I actually have their perfume on today. I thought I would go all out CT. And I really love the makeup brand. I like the fact that it's a really luminous natural brand. And I think as I've gotten older, that's definitely something that stands out to me when it comes to makeup. I am so excited to be getting my makeup done by them um, I think they have some new products released as well which would be really interesting to see I've seen a lot of people use that kind of luminous blush I think and I've, I don't own that I've never had it I might pick one up today because I have been really interested in trying it I always wanted to get my makeup done by Charlotte Tilbury because I think one it would be really great experience to see how they do my makeup but two just because it's Charlotte Tilbury so who wouldn't want to get the makeup done by them today's video that's exactly what i'm going to be doing i'm going to be taking you along with the ride with us and we're going to go and get my makeup done and i'm actually really excited so the first thing they've done when i walked in at the counter is skin prep now as you can see here i'm getting the magic serum on my face now this method kirsten actually told us is better for absorbing the product into your skin instead of rubbing this eye serum had such a cold end to it, it really felt like it was like de puffing my eyes. I really felt a difference straight away with this. I enjoyed getting it on. And then we went in with some eye cream. As of recent, I've started using eye cream and I really do think it benefits your face and your eyes. And then the famous magic cream, of course. I use this product on the daily now and I really like it. This is Kirsten's Instagram, if anybody's interested, Kirsten is the lovely lady who's doing my skin prep. And then she went in with a collagen oil. I've never used this product before, um, so I was really intrigued by it. It felt really nice on the skin and it had a gorgeous spa smell. Like, you know when you're sitting in the spa getting a facial, the smell was just so strong. It reminded me of a spa and I really, really liked it. It was really interesting getting so much skin prep done because I've never ever had my, my skin prep this much before getting my makeup done and the last skin prep I got was the lip oil. This is how gorgeous my skin was after, can you believe it? So then we moved on to doing my actual makeup so I got the Flawless Filter Primer on. You can find Shannon who done my makeup Instagram on the screen now if you are looking for any makeup bookings. And then I went in and got the Flawless Airbrush um, shade, uh, Foundation in shade 6. Now I'm not going to lie, never ever tried this product before. So it was a new product for us to try. I really love the way it looks on my skin. It gives you a little luminous base, which is personally what I look for in a foundation. And then she went in with a concealer. I've left all of the shades and everything on the screen so you can save them for reference. She did also use this same product in a darker shade for contour. I think it was shade 14 that she went in for for the contour. I really um, found it interesting the way she pulled the concealer quite high up my eye and I felt like she used quite a lot of product which when I'm doing my makeup personally I don't. If you follow this Instagram on the screen now it is the girls at Elden Square Phoenix who do all the Charlotte Tilbury makeup if you're looking to kind of begin for an appointment or anything like that. I really liked how gorgeous this blended in my skin. You can really see how it makes you kind of have a complexion on your face, but it's a really nice color. It's not too orange toned or dark. And then we set my face. Um, I do realize that the powder wasn't put all over my face. She said kind of certain areas, which I think was nice because it still left a really natural glow on my cheek, which I really, really liked. Um, so yeah, once we have set, she then went in with a bronzer. This is in the shade 2 medium. I've never used this bronzer before, but I do use the Charlotte Tilbury bronzer, but it's the one that comes in the duo with the highlight. That's the one that I use on the daily basis in my makeup collection. I got and then for eyebrows, a mixture of products were used to kind of give my brows a fluffy, defined look. I really like how the end result turned out. I thought they looked really pretty and quite natural as well, which is something that I do go for these days. 
former eyeshadow look. This was the new Pillow Talk eyeshadow. So this is part of the new collection. I think it's a really beautiful quad palette. It has two shimmers in and two mattes. So as you can see here, yeah, Shannon is just using the shadows to kind of build up a really, really pretty colour. Um, I went for in the end, it was like a gorgeous smoky eye. And I love the way it's kind of foxy, how she brings it out. I cannot do that when I'm doing my own makeup. So when I get something like this, I feel really fancy. And then she is using the darker shade as well to kind of darken that area up. Honestly, I'm not even going to try and use like proper makeup terminology because I don't have a bloody clue what I'm talking about. One shade added the shimmer shade, so then added a shade under my eye as well. Now this is something that I do do on my own makeup routine. I really like having a little bit of colour under my eye. And then she went in with an eyeliner. I never use eyeliner, so when I get my makeup done, it's a little bit of a treat getting someone to do a bit of an eyeliner on us. So she just put it on my waterline at the bottom and then also ran it along my lash line at the top as well. And I really do think give my eyes a really dark, dramatic, dramatic effect. And I think my eyes really stand out when I wear um, dark eyeliner so I really like this mascara I got a burgundy mascara would you believe at first I was a bit like oh okay but it looked so pretty now for my lips we use the pillow talk product so she went in with the liner you can actually get a duo set online I've seen for 40 pound of the liner and the lipstick <laughs> And then the Pillow Talk gloss, your girl loves some gloss, like I just love gloss, so I was really happy to get a little bit of gloss on the lips. This was a really nice one and it wasn't sticky either, which I really like. And then this is also part of the new Pillow Talk collection, it's kind of a lip and cheek tint. Look how gorgeous that is. Are you seeing what I'm saying? Like it is absolutely beautiful. I really liked how glowy it was. It was a very subtle shade, but it did give you that color on your face. I love this product. Look at that. Again, this highlight that is from the new Pillow Talk collection. It was really gorgeous. Like look at that. How gorgeous is that? Such a kind of natural everyday highlight as well though not too much and not too glittery. That's why I really like liquid highlights because I feel they don't give you that kind of you've run glitter across your cheek look. They give you like a gorgeous glow. I got There's also a brand new compact highlight out as part of the new Pillow Talk collection, which we used a little bit of that on my cheek as well. So it really did have that like a luminous look at the end. It was absolutely gorgeous. Get yourself a little bit of setting spray because you want this makeup to stay on for as long as possible. And this, my friends, is the finished look. How glowy, luminous, gorgeous, it complements my features so much. So all of these products on the screen now are the products that were used on my face as well as some additional. So you can see that there is the mascara, the quad, this is the new Pillow Talk collection and honestly I thought the products were beautiful. I've done some working out in terms of like the value of the items and stuff because if you follow us you know I love that type of thing. So the total cost for the full products that were put on my skin including skincare and makeup was £680. So if you wanted to buy every single product used on my skin that's how much it would cost. Very high end, very, very expensive, but I do feel the products give you a like a gorgeous complexion. If you just wanted to buy all the makeup products, it was £360, and if you just wanted the skincare, it was £290. So Charlotte Tilbury is a very high-end brand, but honestly, I do feel like investing in some high-end pieces is worth it for your skin and for the overall look. Now, I'm not saying you have to have every single high-end product that they do, but I think having some pieces in your routine can really complement your face. Guys, it's 20 past 8 and I am in my jammies now, but this is the makeup. It's still absolutely flawless. And I've had it on, so I got it done from just say one or two. So had it on, seven hours. I've been in wind, I've been in rain. It's flawless, my friends. We are flawless. I'm honestly so happy with the makeup. Um, I think you could just say at the end, I literally was feeling a whole other level of confidence. 
The thing is, is when makeup artists play around with a really dark eye on my eyes, I really, really like it because I can't play around with dark eyes. It looks like I've been beat up every time I try to create like an eye shadow that's like dark colours. But when someone does it and they have like a technique and they know what they're doing, I honestly just love it. I think my eyes suit it. My eye colour stands out loads. Like I just think this makeup suits my face to a T. Just a little bit obsessed with myself. I tell you, if I wasn't obsessed with myself before, I fucking am now. Let us know what you think about the makeup look below. Would you get your makeup done at charlotte tilbury so you can't actually get your makeup done at the charlotte tilbury's counters it's 55 pound but that is redeemable on products so you can get like products up to the value of 55 pound or spend more um and get your makeup done free of charge obviously what was created on me and i think it's absolutely gorgeous i really just wish i'd got it done on a night where i was going out because uh yeah i'm keeping it on until i go to bed like just in case i think of any content ideas i'll be like i'll be filming that I really love it. I just think it's absolutely gorgeous. You have been on the journey with us of getting lots of different makeup looks. It's really nice to hear your opinions and feedback on the makeup products. The skincare as well, can I just say? So my skin got prepped as well um, before I got my makeup on. And the skincare prep at Charlotte Tilbury is next level on the daily i use the magic cream and i have done for quite a long time now i think it's a brand that's really into prepping and skincare and all that type of thing because they did use a lot of skincare products more than any other makeup artist or makeup brand ever has before before i've had my makeup done so i think that was like the biggest difference i noticed when getting my makeup done with charlotte tilbury i don't know if this is across all stores i know if this happens at every single charlotte tilbury counter but it definitely happened today for me so yeah i'm going to love and leave you on this video i really hope you enjoyed it if you've got any other videos your suggestions to do with makeup let us know and i can definitely add it to the list to get done for you so much for watching this video i love you all so much and i'll see you very shortly for another one bye